Karnal Anurag Shukla, thank you for joining. Please explain to us what makes Astra one of India's most powerful combat aerial tool. DRDO and BDL who has developed this in 2017, this has been one of the most successful indigenous missile which we have developed. There are three variants, Mark 1, Mark 2 and Mark 3. They are air to air missile and air to surface missile. They can act in either role and they are being deployed and they are being inducted by Indian Air Force and Indian Navy. They can be integrated with the SU-30 Tejas, our own Tejas and Rafal which has recently been inducted. So coming to the uh, ranges, which I start with the ranges, first thing is the Astra missile are in three variants, that is Mark 1, Mark 2 and Mark 3. Mark 1 has been inducted, Mark 2 are in the stage of induction and Mark 3 is in the trial stages. Mark 1 has got a range of approximately 80 to 110 kilometers, while Mark 2 has got a range of 130 to 160 kilometers. The third stage, third Mark missile, which has been introduced, it is 340 kilometer range and a very, very uh, precise weapon which has got an initial guidance system in build and they have got a uh, fiber optic gyroscope which is able to change the course and route and the data can be fielded from the uh, uh, aircraft or ground radars. So that is a very deadly weapon and the missile and this has got a capability to reach head on approximately 4.5 mac that is mean key speed of sound multiply by 3.5 that is a speed which is can take the range you can estimate an air to air missile in the recent concluded or ongoing uh, operation sindur you can see here we have used this extensively there has been a very great success some has been told some has not been told it has been told that j10 and j17 has been brought down and one f16 has also been brought down but though no official confirmation has been made from either side of the countries but definitely this missile has caused a havoc i will like to tell you the propulsion system the propulsion system of this system is solid fuel and which is able to reach uh, instant speed of 4.5 meg and cutting the range of 160 kilometer is really a achievement and i would like to once again uh, me, uh, congratulate everybody that are making India program and uh, taken by my or own DRDO and BDL this has been the most successful indigenous missiles we have made if you see in the air to air role Air to air roll when the aircraft goes in the air and it is encountering another aircraft and there is a dog fight. The what first thing we should do, we have to come over the speed of the aircraft. At the same time, our speed has to be uh, much faster than the enemy aircraft. So here when we are reaching a Mach 4.5, that is actually a very high speed. And then if you see, there are two ways. If you are saying chase. Chasing may, it is getting a speed of a range of 20 km while it is going to face on that is time it is achieving a range of 80 to 160 km. So it is a very, very precision weapon. And second thing, definitely it has got a initial guidance system as well as a capability to uh, on course correction from external input so that makes a very precise and deadly weapon you'll be surprised it is able to take 15 kg of warhead that is a very big amount